We are going to learn a lot about this UK team over the next five games. Four are on the road, and the fifth is at home against Texas A&M. This is a typical season for Coach Cal. Up and down. They need an up tonight at LSU at 830. Alan Cutler has more on a team that is fighting for something we don't normally see at UK. Respect. If you're an athlete, and if you are a competitor, it bothers you. And I know it's bothering some of the players more than they're going to tell us. Are you kidding? Kentucky wins two games and they drop in the poll? They're not happy, and they shouldn't be. Oh, yeah, it bothers us, but we can't, can't do nothing about it. That's, that's, that's people's opinions. And, <laughs> what, what did Cal say about dropping? Uh, no, we just got to fight harder now to give us motivation. The old Cal, that's before Kentucky, he loved to use the us against the world or we are the underdog. That's tough to do when you coach Kentucky. But he's pushing hard because it's so natural to Cal to say we are getting no respect. So it's not who we played. It's that people watch us and really don't think we're that good. I said either they don't think you guys are that good or they don't think I can coach. Or how about this one? Maybe it's both. They don't think I can coach or you can play. Let's see. It's January, so Cal's complaining that the team doesn't talk enough. Cal is complaining that the team doesn't play together enough. Sounds normal. Oh, I don't want to use that word, but as Cal says, it's a process. And for today, against Georgia, the team took a step back. Alan Cutler, LEX, 18 Sports. Another Wildcat has decided to transfer. Running back Bryant Kobach says he needs to be closer to family due to unforeseen circumstances. He didn't play in his freshman season and has been granted the release to transfer to Eastern Michigan or Toledo. UK Athletics Director Mitch Barnhart felt the need to defend Benny Snell Jr. and he did that today on Twitter, calling him a quality young man who has his full support and says his actions in the bowl game weren't worthy of being ejected. Lexington Catholic head football coach Mark Perry has resigned his position at the school to join fellow Wildcat Neil Brown at Troy. He'll be the director of football operations. No word on who will replace him. Dunbar has hired its next head football coach, Wes Johnson, one-time head coach at West Jessamine, takes over for Chris Mullins, who resigned after two seasons. Johnson takes over a program that was 3-18 and during that time. You know, I taught here, uh, coached here for a couple years, and, you know, it's just a, one of those things where you are around a group of people and around a community, and, and you just feel a bond with it. Um, obviously, my kids uh, are in the system, and I'm looking forward. My little daughter graduates here 2032, so I plan to be around for a while. <laughs> That'll be some time. LEX 18 News will be right back.